Well, hey there, Rhea Reeves, founder and finance coach of City Girl Savings here, coming at you with a very quick training all about what goes into a successful budget plan. Obviously, you know a budget is very important to reach your financial goals, provide clarity in your life, and ultimately relieve some mental pressure. But maybe you struggle with what actually makes a successful budget plan. I got you covered. First, let's start with the ultimate budget baseline. Okay, I want to keep things very simple here and make sure we focus in on the most important pieces of a budget. And those pieces include your total income. So how much money do you plan to have coming in over the course of the month? your total expenses, including variable. So how much spending do you plan to do over the month? And if you don't know what variable expenses are, they are things like gas, groceries, getting your hair and nails done, going out to eat, things that we spend money on, but they don't have a set amount and due date every month. We want to make sure to include those numbers as well. And then a plan for your profit. So ultimately, you're going to take your total income for the month and subtract it by your total expenses. That number that is left over is your profit. Now, if that number is negative, it means that you are spending more than you make and you got to change something. If that number is positive, woohoo, you are profitable. What are you going to do about it? Are you going to save? Are you going to put more towards debt? Having a plan for profit beforehand allows you to work towards your goals. Now, if you're wondering, well, I always struggle with, you know, what, what category should I should include in my budget? Here's a list of categories that everyone should have in their budget, if these apply to you, of course. So savings, housing, personal bills, groceries, transportation, meals out, debt payments, fund spending, and miscellaneous. Now, miscellaneous is almost like your catch-all category. So anything that wouldn't fall in these other categories, but it is a recurring expense, track it under miscellaneous. I wanna share with you a few tips for budgeting success. First, make sure that you include the fun spending. I know I included it as a category that should be in everyone's budget, and that's for good reason. When we deprive ourselves of fun or the things we enjoy, we often end up feeling miserable, and that leads to us splurging. So all the progress we did up until this point is completely thrown out the window because you didn't give yourself any room to enjoy life with. Another tip for success is to make sure you account for unexpected expenses. I do this by increasing my miscellaneous category by $100 a month. I leave $100 kind of open for anything unexpected to pop up because it is inevitable. Now, $100 may be too much or too little for you. Play with the number. Find what works for you and tweak from there. And finally, track your spending. You will not know if your budget is working if you are not tracking your spending to see if you're actually following the budget. This is absolutely critical for success with a budget. So what does it look like when your budget actually works? It's successful, things are going good? Well, first, you don't run out of money between pay periods. Hello, living paycheck to paycheck is a thing of the past. Your savings goes up and or your debt goes down. Because you factor in savings and debt payments into your budget, you are making progress towards both of those goals, meaning your savings is going up and the debt is going down. When your budget works, you know exactly where your money is going. And this is where tracking becomes very important. You can put all the numbers on paper, but if you're not 100% sure of what's happening because you're not tracking, you don't really know where your money goes. But if you track your spending, you sure do know. And finally, you get into a rhythm with your money and budget. Things start flowing smoothly. It's almost like, autopilot like wait why is something not going wrong this is normal when you are following a budget that works 
Now, if you don't really know where to start, I highly suggest you download my free monthly budget overview tracker. You can do so by going to bit.ly forward slash CGS budget or click the link in the email I just sent you. Thank you so much for tuning in and I will see you soon.